Yeah, no more of that. Three shakes is my limit so I don't get robbed. <laughs> I have to power up my Rotom bike some more. Oh, jeez! God! All these Pokemon randomly showing up right on. Leave me alone. I don't want you. Oh, look, it's Pikachu's natural nat natural predator. That Pokemon that just be using dive and then just appears with a Pikachu in its mouth. Not all the time, but it's it's crazy. I'd much rather not do this by myself, though. I hate doing these max raid but max raid battles by myself. Cause these NPCs, these NPCs be useless as all hell, son. Oh my god. But it's fine. Cause I'm just gonna max knuckle the hell out of this Pokemon. <laughs> Sniper Point said, everyone, let's just roast every Pokemon that Don't Cheese fighting. I mean, I don't mind, I don't care. I would probably join in on you guys if certain, because I, I do, as much as I love Pokemon, I do have my opinions on certain Pokemon that just look dumb, like Vanillix's bitch ass. I think Vanillix is the most lazy Pokemon, Pokemon design in the world, son. Did you really make a Pokemon out of ice cream, bro? For real? Yeah, no more of that. Three shakes is my limit so I don't get robbed. Why did I just run right right into this Pancham, son? I didn't want to catch him. Why did I do that to myself? Now I gotta run and make this Pancham feel bad about itself. It's not you, Pancham, it's me. I just don't want you. Ooh, another Gigantamax Corviknight? Fire, great. I don't need it, but I, I can have it now. I hope you got a dope ass fire move on deck. If you want to hear my honest opinion, this game is fire. This game is dope. I love this game. Like I, I, I hear all the things that are wrong with it. I think they're all well warranted opinions, but I don't give a fuck. I'm enjoying this game and it's a, it's a great game to me. I'm looking at the game for what it is. I'm looking at this game's content, what it's offering me. I'm not thinking about what the game took away. And because of that, because of that mindset, I'm enjoying this game way more. I feel like a lot of people are looking at ex are trying to pinpoint every single game this game took away from the original po from the old Pokemon games, and because of that ide ideology, because of that mindset, a lot of people are just saying, seeing like a whole bunch of fucking. They're seeing it as trash. But I feel like if you take this game for what it is and just look at it and say, you know what, it could be good though. Like, what if it is good? What if it is fire? It's like, yeah, there's a high chance you may not like it, but then there's also a very high chance you will like it. So that's not the same. I, I I don't I don't think everybody has that mindset, which is completely fine. That's just me. But I went on a whim. I was also part of the crew that was like, uh, eh, maybe this game is not for me. I don't like the whole Dexit idea. I don't like the fact that I have to um that Mega Evolutions are gone. But I was just like, you know what? Let me try Gigant. Let me try Dynamaxing. Let me try Gigantamaxing. Let me see how this works. And you know what? I have come to love both Dynamaxing and Gigantamaxing. I think they're both some of the coolest, some of the coolest mechanics I've ever seen in a Pokemon game ever. I never thought I would ever, I would, I would actually like battling with giant Pokemon. But the cutscenes when like the gym leaders Dynamaxes their Pokemon, those cutscenes are the most intense cutscenes ever. And my God, suddenly just hype, just got a whole bunch of raid battle spawns. Great, that's what I like to see. But real quick. Let me look at the stats on this on this uh, Corviknight real quick. See how good it is. Ooh! This Corviknight stats are fire! Fire! What's your nature though? Damn! Damn! Lowers attack and raises special defense. That sucks. It's okay. There's there's a candy you can take for that. It's fine. Cameron asks, who's your favorite gym leader in this game? The fighting gym leader. I think her design is great. She reminds me of um Maylene from the Sinnoh region. Who I, she was one of my favorite gym leaders from Jump because I loved how she trained, like actually physically trained with her Pokemon. Like her and Lucario were actually throwing hands, bro. If Pokemon were real and, that's, and I was a trainer, that's exactly what I would do. I would be training physically with my Pokemon. You training, bro? You want to lift the weights? I'll lift the weights with you. That's how we do it. That's how we're supposed to. Act, that's how we're supposed to act with our Pokemon. And I got Dynamax first. This is gonna be easy pickings. And we have two Charizards. Say less. Say less. This Charger Bug is about to catch all the wreck. Omega Wolf said, "I got your back with my Charizard." Oh, that's you. That's that's you in here. All right, cool. Thank you, bro. We about to wreck this Charger Bug right now. Charger Bug is catching all the work. Already died. <laughs> While I do agree that if you enjoy a game, play it. I'm getting kind of sick and tired of these games really of, of people releasing half-assed games and then trying to make it better through deal through DLC and then having you pay for that DLC. Like, stop, like, I don't agree with that shit. Don't give me a fucking cheese pizza and forget the cheese and then charge me for the cheese later. Like, the fuck? That doesn't make any sense. Why would you do that? Funny story, at the end of the last stream, I ran into a Gigantic, a, a Dynamax Charizard raid battle, but it broke out the fucking ball. I was tight. 
I was so mad, but I did run into it. So then that did give me hope thinking that like, okay, you know what? I ran into a max raid battle with a Charizard. Maybe I can run into a max raid battle with other starters. You just caught a fucking Charmeleon, Javi? Damn, or Javi? What the hell, son? I would love to have caught a Charmeleon. I mean, I already have my Charizard, but I mean, I, I would like another one. Back in the day, when you had a good-ass, strong-ass Pokemon, you were known around the block. And people would be talking about you saying, like, yo, you heard this boy, don't you? Had, like, a level 100 Mewtwo, son. I don't know if you guys remember, but back in Pokemon Red, Blue, and Yellow, right? Well, no, sorry, it was just Red and Blue. I don't think the glitch was in Yellow. There was this hack where... What was it again? You had to do something. I cannot remember. But basically, the hack led to you... Surfing on the court surfing on the edge of Cinnabar Island and when you surf on the edge of Cinnabar Island because of the glitch So I think I said hack before it's not a hack because a glitch because of the glitch you were finding random ass Pokemon over level 100 I remember I found a gold that was like 80 level 80 something. I found a Mewtwo level 132 like it was Crazy I was finding such strong ass Pokemon and people thought I was out here doing the most I was like nope Cinnabar Island glitch bro. It's fire, but then I fucked up and almost caught him a signal a right period Okay, I'm down for that. Wait, 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 Amir, wait. Don't, I don't think you should use Bolton, bro. That Rhyperior will eat your Bolton. I, I don't think it's a good idea. Damn, my boy has been jump, has been attacking only that Cinderace. Lit. God damn, that Steelix turned and slapped me right in the face with his head. Jesus Christ, I do not want a Pan Jam. Leave me alone. I get it, you're breaking the mold. That's beautiful. All right, Gigantamax, Dreadnought, you about to catch this work real quick. We gonna catch you, we gonna put you in the box possibly use you you know the deal so i'm gonna send out my gorge ice right quick gonna seed bomb your ass i mean you can raise your defense all you want you're not gonna run away from this work bro wait wait who was that for damn toxicity i'm sorry that happened to you oh damn we about to beat this dreadnought yeah we beat the dreadnought cool get in my belly by belly i mean pokeball what nigga why? Why did you leave? Come on, stay the ball. What's wrong with you? You don't want you don't want to be my friend? You don't want to be my friend, bro? Damn, he heard me say he's gonna go in the box and he was like, nah, bro. Nah, I'm good. At the end of the day, at least I got the at least I got the rewards. What's going on, Doji fam? Thank you so much for watching another Pokemon video. If you enjoyed this video, please don't forget to like because that really helps the channel out a lot. Share with all your friends, especially those friends who love Pokemon, so we can build a dope ass Pokemon community on this channel. Subscribe if you haven't already, and comment if you want to see me do more videos like this, or if you have any suggestions on how I can make these videos better. Shout out to Fishmon31, Jarrell Horan, Black Link, and all my other dope patrons who make videos like this possible with their very kind donations. And if you are not already a patron but would like to become one, go to my Patreon page in the description below and find out how you could support the channel for as little as $1 a month, fam. And as you know, we also have shirts available. So if you want to get yourself some good old Dolce merch, go to that link in the description below and find and go buy you a shirt. I almost said the Patreon thing, but you know what it is. Go buy you a shirt if you want to get a shirt. It's up to you. However, as usual, if you cannot afford to buy a shirt or become a patron, it's all good, bro. Liking, sharing, commenting, all that good stuff, that still really helps out a lot. Hell, you just watching this video and getting this far helps out a lot. So by that, by that means, just thank you for being here this long. That being said, I'm off this. So as usual, be easy, stay lit, and take care.